Hello Miserable Minions and welcome back to my channel. Today's video I want to talk to you about starfish. I'm going to tell you some really cool and interesting starfish facts. So let's get into the video. So before we get into the video, I want to take a little bit to say this video is sponsored by Pop Voice. They were kind enough to send this microphone. It's a clip-on microphone, so let's open the box. Right, this is what it looks like, Pop Voice. PV510 Plus lavalier microphone. Okay, so when we open the box, it is a very cute little velvet bag to carry our microphone in in case we ever need to travel. Okay, so let's open this up. Directions. And here it has so two wind muffs and a PC adapter. And here is the microphone. And it also comes with this little Velcro thing that says pop voice. Now unfortunately my main camera does not have an output for this. So I'm going to try recording external audio on my cell phone and it's taking it with this video. All right, let's try it. So this is the Pop Voice microphone, the single head lavalier, and it is good for your, your smartphones, your uh, basically any type of phone that can fit like a regular jack like this. It'll work. And what I really like about it is that it has a very long cord, 16 feet, so you're not stuck in one place. You're free to take it. You know, you can walk around while recording. Uh, which is handy for me whenever I'm filming videos uh, with, with my pets. And also, oh my, my, my camera's gonna die. Um, it's very small, so you can take it with you anywhere. It'll fit in your pocket, it comes with a pouch, and it's very handy. And it's only, look, $9.99 if you have Prime, free shipping. Affordable, it's good, I like it, and it has really good reviews also. Okay, now that I'm all mic'd up, hopefully the audio works, hopefully it sounds good, hopefully you can't hear my filters or my AC going. Let's get into starfish facts. So there are more than 2,000 species of starfish, and the majority of them live in the Indian and Pacific Ocean, but not one species can survive in freshwater. So they, ugh. So although they're called starfish, they're not fish at all, but invertebrates. They said inver invertebrates. <laughs> invertebrates. <laughs> that sounds funny. And they're not related to fish. They're more related to sea cucumbers, sea urchins, and that type of stuff. So what do starfish like to eat? They're carnivore. They will eat fish. They will eat shrimp, mussels, clams, oysters, anything like that. They will eat and they can actually pry open the shells of clams to get the yummy goodness inside. So now we know what they eat, how do they eat. Now I have a video, I'll card it right here. It shows you exactly how starfish eat, it's quite interesting, but they eat through pushing their stomach out of the body. So where is that mouth located? It's right on the underside, but on the very top of them is their rear end. <laughs> Did you know starfish do not have brains or blood. Instead of blood, they have seawater, which circulates around throughout their body. And when you look at a starfish, they look quite soft, like a chocolate chip cookie. But in fact, they're not soft at all. Which I have another video, which I'll card right here, of what my pets feel like, and I talk about what a starfish feels like. So I'll explain it one more time. They are hard, very firm. It's actually quite hard to even cut through them. Some people in the marine hobby will keep starfish and will cut off their limbs to feed to their predator fish. And it's very hard to cut through them. I wouldn't know by experience, just from what I've been told. <laughs> now most people think starfish are hermaphrodites, which is not true. They can produce sexually and asexually, which means if you cut them in half, you've heard this before, if you cut a starfish in half, they will reproduce by growing a new starfish. But you have to cut them directly in half as long as it's part of the mouth on each side, it can grow new starfish. Or sexually, as I said, which is 
uh, the male eggs, the male eggs. What the heck am I talking about? The female eggs and the male sperm, which will um, combine to produce a new starfish. <laughs> So that is it for this video. Hopefully you learned something fun and new, and I hope I don't get demonetized for saying about sexual reproduction organs. <laughs> Again, thank you to Pop Voice for sponsoring this video, and I will see you in the new one. Okay, so I'm trying this mic directly through my phone uh, recording, so let's see how it sounds. Um, so thank you again to Pop Voice for sponsoring, and I'll put all the, their link in the description so you can check it out if you want. Uh, and when I was listening back to my previous recording uh, of Starfish Facts, I could still kind of hear the AC running, but I didn't really hear my filter. Uh, an audio program can fix that up. It could take away um, the noise from the background. But other than that, I think it's okay. Um, I haven't heard it through my cell phone yet, but um, yeah, I think it's okay. <laughs> so again, thank you and check them out.